Clive's plan is working. The armistice in Verdansk has officially fallen. It's bloody chaos. Tell me something I don't know. I got a fire team. Operators inbound hot to your position. They better be good. They are. my god guys so season three has literally just dropped today um as i'm recording this 8th of april uh and yeah we've just been given this short little uh cut scene of uh basically season three and um now i never knew anything about this i just thought this was fucking sick so i went out of my way and basically had a look into this because i've not played much of campaign i'm not much of a campaign player and uh yeah a lot of you who have played the campaign will know that this um character at the end of this uh little cut scene for season three uh is alex um, he goes by this name as a way to cover up his tracks because he works for the ceo and Basically, what is going on here um, is apparently he was claimed to be dead, and basically the the, the reason people thought this uh, that um, the reason that Ghost thought that he was dead uh, was because um, there was a mission at the end of campaign where basically uh, Alex um, offered to go in uh, and uh, over Pharaoh. Uh, Pharaoh, is that her name? Farco? I, I, I feel like I'm going to get this so wrong. I'm going to anger people. I think it's Pharaoh. But yeah, he offered, instead of her, to go into um, into this um, facility place um, to basically detonate the place with himself in it. And basically, when he offered to do this, this means, yes, of course, he was not going to be get out, getting out in time when this place blows up. Um, so, of course, um, she said her goodbyes and all that kind of thing at the end, and everyone thought that he was dead. But as usually how movies play out, uh, or games or anything, people don't always know if a character's dead, uh, you see, because people will say, you know, oh, they're, if they're not on screen when they die, they most likely haven't died. The same thing applies to The Walking Dead. But from what I've heard with season nine, I've not watched that far because I'm not interested in the show anymore. But same thing applies with that. You know, when Rick died, uh, well, allegedly died, it was off camera, so no one knows if he's dead or not. So it's the same kind of um, scenario here with Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Um, so we're greeted with our fine uh, operator, Ghost, um, I loved, I loved seeing him in action. This was really good because uh, I've got the, I bought the battle pass, and I really do like this operator and all that. I've been grinding to try and unlock everything for him, and yeah, pretty much. Um, Alex, as I say again, was supposed to have died or thought to be dead, and in this trailer, you can see he's still alive. But he's missing a leg, so he's got a robotic leg, but he's still here. So that was pretty cool. Now that I've looked into the backstory of that, I think that is actually pretty cool. Especially I can see the hype for a lot of Call of Duty Modern Warfare fans. So here is season three. Uh, the battle pass ends in 55 days and 4 hours and 44 minutes. The skins... Um... I mean, some of them are a bit weird. I do like these charms a lot. I do like the gun wraps. They, uh, these are very good gun wraps, in fact. Um, the skin, Some of the skins are okay, I guess. You've got some pretty good banners. Um, well, calling cards, my, my bad. You've got a lot of coins in here, as usual. Uh, card points. And uh, some fancy watches. I've already got some watches already from Season 2. Uh, but basically, I decided to buy Season 2. Because once I've bought Season 2 and grind that whole thing out, I can basically... Um, buy the rest of them in the future so i'm just going to show you all of the tiers so here are hopefully i'm going to show you all of the tiers so if you want to pause you can but i'm just going to show you them all if you're interested Now, of course, if you want to skip uh, this showcase of the tiers, 
I'll put a time on screen to when that's done, just so you don't have to watch any longer. So there you have it, that is the Season 3 tiers, uh, so I'm just going to go buy this real quick because I already have 1,100 COD points, so here you have the standard, um, the standard battle pass, let's purchase that, there we go, we have unlocked Season 3 battle pass, okay, so we are now all, we've got all the season one tiers so far. Uh, I don't know if I'll be changing the skins right now. I really do like Ghost a lot. I think he's one of my favorite operators in the game. Uh, but as you can see, we've got Alex from Warcom. It's great to have him back, I suppose. I, I never knew much about him, but it's great to have him back. Uh, seeing as I've looked into the bit of the story about it. So here is Yegor. Uh, <laughs> he looks. Um, yeah, I mean, I I thought, in all honesty, he looked a bit bent before. If that's like homophobic, isn't it? A little bit, but here uh, you'd think he looks more bent now. But actually, he looks kind of like spooky. He's a convict, of course, so um, something like that. I think he's from the Verdanax prison, if I'm not wrong. So anyone who's got anything you want to tell me, please uh, update me on that. Um, but yeah, oh, I've got these watch this things, but seeing as it's uh, Alex, I'll set the one, two, three as his thingy. Right, so that is uh, the thing. If we if we've got a better skin for this this one, because I love Zane, this is a great skin, this guy. But if we've got a better one, you know, we could we can buy it. I really wanted this, but you actually had to buy a pack for that. So um, yeah. So we'll select this version of Yegor for our. Uh, second skin for allegiance and there you go oh wait where the f uh yeah that's weird well apparently he won't change over that's strange there we go i didn't select him so there you go we've got yegor now the convict and we've got ghost uh, in the white hood looking snazzy as ever so yeah uh if you did enjoy uh thanks for watching i guess um if you did uh Oh, we've got this as well. Uh, be sure to leave a big thumbs up on this video. Comment, subscribe. Be sure to let me know what if you're a Call of Duty player. Be able to tell me, you know, what else this you think this uh, this means for Call of Duty uh, Modern Warfare Season Three. I need to know more. I need, I'm trying to learn more about this game and its backstories because I was never a big player. But yeah. Uh, again do all that but also i want to mention something real quick for anyone who watches me at the moment with youtube there's a bit of an issue with the whole covid19 and the system it's a bit broken if i'm going to be honest so um at the moment i have a problem verifying my phone number it keeps saying there's an error when i try to do it when i try to try someone else's phone number it might work at first try but then i try and go back and change the um the option of the number and it will carry on causing errors so it, apparently it's a big problem with youtube at the moment uh it's it's really weird i don't know why but it's the system's absolutely broke at the moment so if i do not have any thumbnails on my videos or my videos aren't longer than 15 minutes or i can't live stream that's because i cannot verify i'm trying to sort the situation out but please do keep in mind that just because there's no thumbnails on these videos it doesn't mean i don't have thumbnails i have them ready to put up i just can't do it so yeah um, but yeah, thanks uh, for watching again, guys. I thought I'd just update you about that if you watch my channel. Um, but yeah, thank you, and I'll see you all uh, in the next one. So, bye guys. Hope you enjoy Season 3.